Dactylopius coccus distribution. What we'll cover in this video is a research question, the methods we used, and our final results. Our research question is, what is the distribution of Dactylopius coccus within different areas of BFL? To ensure that we cover all grounds of BFL, we have decided to break down our data into four subsections. The plots that we'll be covering is divided into the north, south, east, and west plots. The north region has a dense canopy and is rocky, whereas the east region contained wildflower fields. Next, the west had dense shrubbery and roads that ran along the perimeter, whereas the south had dense shrubbery and um, grassy fields. Our methods included obtaining the coordinates of the cactus patch, identifying the canopy type, and measuring the volume of the cactus patch. We would measure the height of the cactus by starting at the base and measuring to the highest lobe. This would allow us to get the largest volume possible. Next, we captured around 10 pictures of individual cactus lobes within the patch. We made sure to have a scale in the picture for later analysis. We also determined decocus infestation by the presence of white waxy larvae on the lobes. In the lab, we used ImageJ Fiji software to calculate the area of the lobe and decocus infestation. First, we set up a scale in ImageJ for centimeters. We did this by drawing a line on the ruler in the image and using the set scale function within ImageJ. Then we enclosed the area we wanted to calculate by using the shape tool. Lastly, we would use the measure function to provide us the area in centimeters square for the lobe or for the decocus infestation. Our results of infestation at BFL were that the south plot had 57%, the east plot had 0.4%, the west plot had 42.6%, and the north plot had 0% because there were no cacti present. A pattern found throughout our results was a correlation between infestation and open canopies compared to closed canopies. 100% of the infestation occurred in open canopies. In conclusion, with the brief survey of BFL, the west and south plots have the largest presence of Dactylopius coccus. However, a larger survey is needed to be able to present accurate trends within BFL. Thank, Thank you for watching! watching.